focus, focus. There we go. Hey everyone, my name is Boink, or some of you guys may know me as Ricky, or either or, but um, I'm a Fortnite streamer slash YouTuber that was born with all hands, and I know that seems crazy. Like, dude, how, how the heck do you play video games? But um, it's pretty simple for, you know, for Fortnite, I use a Xbox One controller um, on PC. I did originally play on Xbox One, but, you know, I made a transition about, I'm, I'm going to get into that a little bit later, but I'm going to try to keep this sh as short as possible, but if you guys are wondering, I'm 19 years old, I am in college, um, I've been playing video games since I was like 4 years old on like the Nintendo 64, I play games like Donkey Kong, um, Mario, I think, um, GoldenEye was one of them, I think that was a first person shooter, I'm not too sure, if you guys have ever played that, let me know, I'm pretty sure that was a game, it was like a James Bond game, but, um, you know, you can tell from like that how that whole timeline of like me being four years old and then being 19 is pretty long time. But um, I think the biggest game I probably got into was Call of Duty, and I started on Call of Duty. I'm on Call of Duty 3 on like PlayStation 2 all the way up till now, which is like War II. I don't really play it anymore, obviously, because Fortnite's kind of like taken over my life within like the past like year. Um, getting into that, um, whenever Fortnite officially launched the Battle Royale. Um, I think two weeks later I had actually downloaded it on uh, the Xbox One and I didn't really take it too seriously. Um, it was in like another Battle Royale in my opinion. It wasn't anything too crazy because the only Battle Royale I played at the time was PUBG and that was a fun game that I really liked but I have yet to even touch that game since like last year. Sheesh! I was just thinking about that. But um, I, like no one was really heavily into the game and um, video games in general isn't um, too hard for me to catch on like I've always been like a huge gamer so I, I catch on pretty quick but this whole building aspect was something new to a lot of people not only just me so not only was it just a challenge for me but it was a challenge for everyone but during that time no one really built as fast as they do now and you know obviously having two different modes like just fighting and switching different items and then having this build mode where you have to build walls and build ramps it was something new and like you know at first I feel like not a lot of people really were into it but um, as you can tell now, there's people who are doing like bill bells and all types of oh, stuff like that. He actually has no arm. Alright, no hands. No way. Oh, sit the hell down. Oh my god. Pog Risk. freaking champs. <laughs> I, I see respect. Dude, that is respect at its finest. That is dedication. They don't, you know what I mean? They, they, they don't have what everybody, like, well, what most people do have in the world, but they, 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 they use what they got and they make it work. Listen, Chad, if that's not an inspiration, I don't get this, dude. That's all I'm going to say. That is amazing. I need you guys to show my boy Blink some love in the chat, dude. That is actually freaking inspiration. Hey, dude, hey. Thanks for being you. Yeah, dude, all right, chat. His name is the, uh, so this guy, his name is the uh, uh, Blink7, or Blink V uh, I I. In Roman numerals, it would mean Blink7. Uh, all right, uh, dudes. I thought that clip was pretty, uh, pretty powerful. Hey, share that clip with your friends, dude, 100%. We need more people like him out there, you know what I mean? I don't like to see the giver uppers in my life. I like to see people who uh, who like who strive to be something. Um, for the Xbox One controller, um, another reason why I use wired is because um, the response time is a whole lot faster. I don't have to worry about getting batteries. There, I know there's controllers that you may have to charge, but I just find it more convenient to just get a wired controller. You don't have to worry about charging, change batteries, or any of that stupid stuff. Um, but. Um, I put the controller in my lap, right, across my legs. There's probably going to be some clips that you guys are going to see of how I play. Um, it's pretty simple. Across my legs, um, to aim in, I use my left leg crossed over my right leg. So whenever I want to aim in and shoot somebody, I just press the controller like into my leg. And then I use my right arm to um, shoot the weapon as well. And simultaneously, I move both analog sticks with my left arm with like my elbow on this end. It's kind of hard to explain. I do have a tutorial on my channel if you guys want to go check that out. Um, on how I play. I'll probably even make a new one just to put it, put it in more depth. It, it's, it's very confusing. I know some of you guys may catch on just by looking at the footage. Some of you guys may not catch on. It's a lot to understand. You know, this isn't normal. But, um, 
a couple months after the Fortnite Battle Royale release, I remember TSO Myth had came to my stream, and he said he was he was really like intrigued, you know, of what I was doing. And this is before he joined TSO. You, you you know, it's the same person. But he was saying like, dude, you know, you could be really good. Like, do you, have you ever thought about playing PC? Now I have played Fortnite on PC with mouse and keyboard. That's another video I really plan on doing. It has some pretty good clips of me like destroying some people. This dude plays with no hands. Hold on, bro. Oh, he he playing on an Xbox controller with no hands. Hold on, bro. Look at this shit. I didn't really take the game seriously until I started seeing Myth play, and after I was like, you know, wow, like this dude's like he's freaking crazy, and this is around the time when he was just first blowing up. So I didn't make the full transition from Xbox One to PC until January, where I just completely switched to just Fortnite only, and from there, um, I just f focused on improving my own performance, watching people in TSM, you know, like Hamlin, Daquan, and Myth, and how they built. Because I think those were the only people around at the time, like, as a team, that really, you know, had that chemistry that a lot of people were kind of, like, looking for. So I used their tactics, you know, their play styles and how they approach different enemies and incorporated that into my own um, to be able to, you know, perform at a better, you know, level than what I already was before. I didn't always build as fast as I do now, um, nor do I think I'm the fastest builder. I don't think I'm the best player. I don't think I'm any of that, but I'm definitely way better than I ever was. Or ever have been in the past and I still you know aim to be better than what I am right now my overall goal with YouTube and with Twitch and with all of the stuff is to um, you know be an example and show people that you can do anything that you want to regardless of like w like whatever condition that you have like there's really no excuse the only excuse or the only di like how should I put this the only handicap or disability in life is a bad mindset and I'll say that I don't look at this as this as a disability. I look at it more of a handicap, um, rather than something that stops me from doing something or anything in life. That, uh, any anything that I like to do, um, I think of it as something that's going to be in my way in my life. That used to actually be something that you know I would see as something that hinders me, but now um, you know I'm able to do things that not, with people with hands that came and do like you know as in Fortnite. Not everyone can build this way. I'm pretty sure. Uh, you may know a friend, if you think you're good at Fortnite, you may have a friend who's not even able to keep up and, you know, I may be able to build faster than them. I'm not saying that I'm better than everyone else, but just to keep that in mind. Um, but overall, my goal is just, you know, to show people that just to play games, have fun, you know, no matter what your situation is, like, dude, freaking play Fortnite, like, practice, you know, like, that's all I ever did. You know, I, I still have room for improvement. I've gotten great, great, <laughs> like, tremendous support from like bigger people that I never even thought would even say my name, like Myth, Daquan, uh, TSMOP, uh, FaZe Jailmock, like all these people support me, especially FaZe Clan. FaZe Clan is the biggest one, they've been with me since like 2016, that's crazy. Like that, that's, that, that's the biggest organization that there is in the gaming platform, which is automatically ridiculous. So you can see where I'm coming from and how much support, you know, uh, people have and how many people like look up to me, even the pros, it's not just the smaller people. You know, this isn't something you see every day. And, you know, with that being said, I'm not going to take up too much of your time. Uh, I want to thank Twitch Moments for giving me this platform and this time to be able to, like, you know, reach out to you guys and talk to you guys for a little bit. I uh, hope you guys do like the video. You know, subscribe to Twitch Moments. Subscribe to, you know, me as well. 
Um, I'm pretty sure all my social media links will be down in the description. I try to stream every day, so you guys can go follow my Twitch as well. Um, you're more than welcome to do that. <laughs> to do that. Um, if you guys have any questions, you know, just ask me. You know, comment. You know, tweet at me. Uh, if you're watching live stream, just come in and ask me. You know, what's up? You can maybe even get a few games in. But um, hope you guys do enjoy your day. Make sure you guys turn on notifications too for Twitch moments if you guys want to see more compilations. And make sure you guys turn on notifications for my channel as well if you guys want to see some videos. And thank you. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. And I'll see you guys later. Blink VII. Oh, shit, yo. I know who you are. Yo, what up, dude? Think of the $1. Love you too, man. Yo. I better see you on phase con. That's all I'm gonna say. Okay? I better see you on phase.